Welcome to Indiana Diecast Racing. Today, we're continuing the round one action with group three. Being a big fan of Ferraris, I've really been looking forward to this group. The top seed in group three is the Ferrari F40, the heaviest qualifying car in the tournament at 52 and a half grams. The Porsche 918 Spyder is much lighter at 31.6, but almost as fast. The Lancer Evolution and Volkswagen Golf are big question marks as they both DNF'd on one of their qualification laps. This group will also be the first to use the newly upgraded starting gate, crafted from the finest junk wood and random screws. The Ferrari leads them out of the gate. The Spider has a poor start and the Evo takes advantage. The Evo enters the triangle too fast and flips. The Golf can't get around him and the two skid to a stop in the last turn. The Evo almost made it all the way around the triangle on his roof. The Ferrari and Porsche easily take top points, but the Evo definitely sets a new record for distance traveled while inverted. Since the Evo is not on his wheels, he'll earn zero points for this lap. The judges have ruled that since the Golf is at least partially on the track and on his wheels, he will earn two points for third place. A great start for the Evolution ends in disaster, and he'll have a hard time catching the F40 and Spider. No change to the front two as we start the next lap. The Evolution gets squirrely and the Ferrari and Porsche take off. Coming out of the triangle, the Ferrari and Porsche get sideways and it's a cluster at the finish line. We'll have to go to instant replay to see how it played out. Looks like both the Ferrari and Porsche get sideways and connect on the final straight. They give the Evolution a wide lane that he fails to take advantage of. Lots of bumping and banging and the Porsche is able to get around the Ferrari for the win. The Tricky Triangle has really been living up to its name so far and this is only the third group to run. And after two, the Ferrari and Porsche have a solid four point lead. Things are really gonna need to turn around for the Evo and Golf if they want to avoid a round one exit. The F40 and Spider swap spots for lap three and the green flag's out. Porsche gets sideways, and the Ferrari takes a big lead. The group spreads out and cruises to the finish line. Once again, the Ferrari and Porsche take the top spots. One lap to go, and this one's already over. Both the Evo and Golf are so far behind, they're eliminated. This last lap will just decide who's number one. Again, the Porsche gets sideways and the Ferrari takes off. The Golf makes a great pass going into the triangle. He catches the F40 on the home stretch, but can't quite make the pass. The Ferrari looks like he lost all kinds of speed in the triangle, and the Golf was nearly able to steal a win. The Ferrari and Porsche coast into round two on some solid scores. The Ferrari wins three out of four laps and racks up the highest round one score so far. This has been Jim D. with Indiana Diecast Racing. Check in again soon for more Round 1 action.